Welcome back to the Owl Talk Podcast. I'm your host, Drew Carpenter. This week, we have the pleasure of chatting with Alexander Pettigrew, who serves as the Director of Programs for Sigma Pi. Alex will be providing insight into the Mid-Year Leadership Conference. Glad to have you back on the podcast, Alex. It's good to be back, Drew. I appreciate you talking with me about the Mid-Year Leadership Conference today. Absolutely. I'm excited to dive into this topic some more so our undergraduate students and even our alumni members can learn about this upcoming education. That being said, if you don't have anything else, we'll go ahead and dive right in. Yeah, let's do it. Perfect. So my first question for you, the second virtual only mid-year leadership conference is coming up in January. What are some things about MYLC that our members should know? Absolutely. So I think starting off, you made a good point with your question. This is a virtual mid-year leadership conference. So with that, We've increased the accessibility of the event for all of our members. Um, We've also increased the accessibility when they're utilizing the platform as well. So for the Mid-Year Leadership Conference, we will be utilizing Attendee Hub. And within that platform, it's going to allow our members to come in, go to their sessions, network with other members from across the country, network with speakers, and they're going to be able to join those sessions immediately and bop around going between session and session for the ones that are going to be most helpful for them and allow for them to better understand their roles. So I think to your question, uh, accessibility is going to be huge. Uh, We're inviting all of our members and they're going to be able to really take a lot away from this platform and this conference again this year. Very nice. You know, having been to a, an in-person Mid-Year Leadership Conference back in the day, I remember that accessibility, that in-person accessibility. So it sounds like we're still having that opportunity just in a virtual platform. Absolutely. We know members love the in-person experience, so we try to tailor the virtual experience to be the same or as close as it can be. So Even though it's virtual, we do want to provide opportunities for our members to be able to engage as if they are in person again. Awesome. I love that. You know, my second question for you, uh, who all is expected to attend the Mid-Year Leadership Conference? Yeah, so originally when we ran the Mid-Year Leadership Conference in person, there were select members of the Executive Council who would join us. With the move to the virtual environment, We actually have invited the chapter sage, vice president, treasurer, secretary, historian or herald, our first counselor, and our new member education chairman. On top of the entire executive council being invited to join us along with that committee member, uh, we're also inviting our province archons and chapter advisors or our volunteers in general where they'll have their own separate track of programming and education that's going to be provided to them throughout the week. So overall, all of your executive council members are going to be invited to this event, your new member education chairman, and your volunteers. So what I'm hearing is everybody should have their calendars open for January 10th or 12th. Absolutely. This is going to be another great opportunity for Sigma Pi to come together, provide some really, really helpful programming for our members. Uh, Whether you are a current executive council member or rising executive council member, This is going to be a great opportunity for you to get programming and education on your role, as well as just learning from other members from across the country as far as how they're conducting their processes, how they're going through and actually operating as a chapter. Very nice. And I think that's a good segue into this third question. What makes this program different from other Sigma Pi programs? Absolutely. So this is one of our larger programs within Sigma Pi. Um, especially with the change to it being virtual. So typically when you are going through different Sigma Pi programs and events, uh, there's going to be content that is specific to certain topics pertaining to that time of the year. When it comes to the Mid-Year Leadership Conference and your question, what makes this one different, is this is geared specifically towards developing our current and rising chapter leaders. So when you come to this event, our goal is to make sure that you leave 
with a better understanding of how to be a chapter president, how to be the treasurer of your chapter. Regardless of whatever role you're in, our goal is going to be the same and the fact that we want to make sure you leave and you're better prepared to do your job and we're giving you those assets, tools, and resources to do so. And with all that being said, how do members register for the 2023 Mid-Year Leadership Conference? That's definitely an important question, Drew, so I see why you saved it for last. Uh, The process to register for the Mid-Year Leadership Conference is as easy as ever. Uh, All you're going to have to do is go to sigmapi.org. You can hover to our events section. And once you click on that, you'll be able to click on the tab for the Mid-Year Leadership Conference. Once you're on that page, you'll get a myriad of information pertaining to the event. But then once you scroll down, you'll actually see that there is an option for you to go ahead and register. So once again, go to sigmapi.org, go to the event section, click on Mid-Year Leadership Conference, scroll down, and you'll be able to register from there. That sounds easy enough, Alex. I can't wait for mid-year, and I'm sure all of our listeners are excited to register and attend as well. Absolutely. And we're looking forward to having everybody join us for another virtual mid-year leadership conference. We really hope that everybody who's listening to this and everyone who's going to be joining us for the event are going to take away a lot of good information that's going to allow them to be better chapter leaders and better officers within their own communities. And again, you can learn more on our website at sigmapi.org slash MYLC. But that will be it for today's episode. Thank you for joining us for the Owl Talk podcast. And thank you, Alex, for giving us some insight into mid-year. For everyone listening, make sure you hit subscribe and please leave a rating and review on your favorite podcast platform. And as always, I believe.